What's up, YouTube? I know we have uh, a lot of catching up to do, but one thing that I do gotta tell you is, if you're into making your own builds and making your own coils, and you're used to the billow, and you're used to um, you know the orchids, uh, there was a new tank that came out. It, it was invented uh, and made by Steam Crave. It's called the Aroma Nizer. And let me tell you something about this tank. It is flawless, okay? If you're into vertical coils standing up straight, this is the one for you. This has a velocity deck style. Uh, it comes with an extra glass in there. I'm not gonna go into the full details on this. I'm just giving you a heads up about what's really hot in the market. Uh, the improvements that this particular tank has done, uh, Billow and Orchids should take a number from this book because these guys really did outdid themselves this time. Um, it works like a sub ohm tank. And if you don't know what's a sub ohm tank, sub ohm tanks are the tanks that come with a, uh, sorry, with a coil on there, okay? Um, right now, the best tank right now, sub ohm tank in the market happens to be the trifecta. For those of you who have a trifecta, um, you notice that there's a gasket. That gasket goes uh, between the coil and the chimney to stop leakage. A lot of people don't know that and they're not putting that gasket in there and all of a sudden they just don't like the tank. And I get it. Um, I got my uh, aromanizer sitting on my DNA 200. And one of the things that probably does bother me, it doesn't bother me, but it might bother others. Uh, the fact that the airflow has to be adjusted by a band, okay? Now the band could be used as a safety feature as well as utilizing it or using it for blocking one airflow halfway, the other one halfway. And they are gonna be halfway, you know? That gives you a little bit more flavor. What makes this tank so unique, not only that it has the velocity style post in there that allows you to do a vertical coil, but the simple fact that the air hose is right at the coil, right at the coil. Um, and it's a six mil juice, you can fit it in there. Now it comes with a different drip tip. Um, I don't like that drip tip that it comes with. So it's a nice little short boy, but I put my cherry bomb drip tip in there and I'm on my way. It looks kind of funny, but the vaping production, I really don't care. Come on, man, it's flawless. Awesome tank. Not disappointed one bit with this. Um, holds a lot of juice. Great vapor production. The cons, bottom filled just like a billow um, as well. So, might be a con for some people. Um, but I don't mind filling it up from the bottom. Um, what makes it also unique is it has a chimney that's very thick. It's about six millimeter in length or wide, and it just runs right through the drip tip. So that makes it a good plus. Very good tank, pretty costly. It's gonna set you back this little baby here about $42. Uh, Steam Crave, great knowledgeable guys there that made this. It comes in three mils and in six mils. Um, it'll give you a glass to shorten it because everything inside has to be shortened as well. So you will have to buy a totally different uh, aromanizer, uh, a three mil aromanizer or a six mil aromanizer. You can also get the, the velocity style decks or you can get a three post deck um, for your angles, coils. But other than that, this is a great, great tank. Works well with my DNA, it's at 80 watts, working perfect. I hope everyone's having a great night. Good Halloween. You guys have a good one. Um, I'm maintaining. I was in a hit and run accident and sidelined me from work. So every free time that I have, I'll be uploading videos and going back to my subscribers. 
and just giving them a little bit more knowledge uh, because I learn as I go as well. Uh, I don't know everything because the vaping industry is moving so quickly that you have to learn as we go as well with their new products. And this is one good new product and I had to share it with you guys. So God bless. Have a good one. Peace.